So today we're in Morton Hall, Bowes and Edmunds, just outside the customer's house. I'll take you inside and show you uh, what it is we're doing. So as we come through, in the dining room there we've got uh, Max, my dad is uh, cleaning the carpet. But while he's doing that, I'm just going to show you how we prep a room for cleaning. As you can see, the room is still fully furnished. We haven't asked the customer to remove all the furniture. We will do all that. As there's two of us that come through every job, it's very easy for us to lift and move your furniture between us. We're fully insured to do this. So the first steps for prepping this room is going to be hoover the middle area of the room. Once I've hoovered the middle area, then we'll, between us, move the furniture into the middle then allowing me to hoover around the outside of the room and then it's time to start cleaning. You can see this one display cabinet here. The only thing we've asked the customer to remove themselves was some china items out of here. Everything else we will move ourselves. So this is us in the middle of cleaning a an average living room. Uh, it probably looks a bit chaotic at the moment. Um, that's because we've moved all the furniture from the outside of the room into the middle so we can clean around the outside of the room and then we'll move the furniture back and we'll clean the middle of the room. So you can tell by this that we really do move all your furniture. We don't ask you to do it. We move it very carefully. We're fully insured to move it. There you can see my dad just cleaning back where the TV would normally sit. Once we've uh, cleaned the whole of the outside of the room, we'll put all this furniture back as I was saying, and then we'll put them on coasters just to help protect the carpet. Um, and then it'll be time to clean the middle of the room. And here you can see the room as we finished. Lovely clean carpets. Um, any furniture that's needed it we've put up onto coasters such as these blocks here under this cupboard. It's just to allow, to allow some air to get underneath, let it dry. Hello Mr Turner, we've just finished cleaning your carpets, just wanted to know what you thought. I'm really impressed by the way that you've cleaned many of the stains I didn't think would come out. I made the hall look particularly good, where I thought it would have to be replaced, and uh, done in a very professional way, and I haven't had to lift anything. Thank you very much. Thank you Mr Turner.